Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Most oven repairs will require some disassembly of the appliance. Before you attempt this, first shut off the power supply to the oven. To access components behind the oven's control panel, first remove the control knobs. Next, remove the screws securing the upper trim. and pull the trim off. Now, pull the control panel forward, reach behind, and slide the indicator light off of the jewel. Disconnect the wires from the oven light switch, and set the control panel aside. Next, remove the screws to release the control housing. Uninstall the screws securing both the selector switch and the thermostat. Now, disconnect the clock wires and set the housing aside. When the repair is complete, reconnect the clock wires Guide the indicator light through the control housing and position both the selector switch and the thermostat. Reinstall the screws to secure. Replace the screws to secure the control housing. Reconnect the wires to the oven light switch on the control panel and slide the indicator light onto the jewel. Align the control panel. Replace the upper trim. And secure the screws. Replace both control knobs. Some repairs may require you to completely uninstall the oven. To do this, open the oven door and remove the screws in the side trim, securing the oven to the cabinet. Have an assistant help you to slide the oven out of the cabinet and set it on a towel or carpet. Depending on the installation, you may need to detach the power cable from the junction box to completely remove the oven. To remove the oven door, open the door to the broil position and lift it up and off the hinge supports. Reinstall the oven door by aligning it with the hinge supports and push the door into position. Reinstall the oven itself by first reconnecting the power cable if necessary. Now slide the oven back into position in the cabinet. Replace the screws in the side trim to secure. You're now ready to turn the power supply back on and check the oven to confirm it's functioning properly.